Okay, we've got a lot of choices on our next quests. Well, how about we um, deposit all our stuff and mm. say, let's take a little break from questing. Okay. Because I want to explore this rich new world. Yeah, yeah, that sounds good. It's brave Jeez. new territory. I'll take, take a sleeping bag. Yeah. Should we ditch most of our tools as well? Because these are actually. I'm going to keep. I've only got an axe that I can use. Um, I feel like we might find something that we can mine that we want to use. That's true. I'm going to leave my Gallagher saw and work blade here because they're really useful for like crafting things. Yeah. But I'm going to keep my hatchet and shovel. I'm going to keep my hatchet. Take some food as well. Yeah. Um, I filled my backpack with ice cream. But it's likely that... So this mod, okay, makes it very hard to um, <laughs> do the early stuff. But I feel like the village that we find, if we find a village, is going to mm -hmm. have so many things that make a lot of things redundant. That's you know true. I mean? We might be able to skip a few steps. Exactly. So let's go out. So I, when I was building this house, Ben, I did see a village that we can explore. Oh, yeah. Behind the mountains. It's here on the left. On, let's just shut the door. Oh, yes, of course. Yes, otherwise uh, we'll get uh, creepy crawlies coming in. Okay, what, well, the mountain that's behind the house? Yeah. Okay. One with the ant. Is he still there? Can't see him. Oh, no, he's gone. Oh, that's okay. That's good. That's good. Did the ants come out at night, or were they a daytime I thing? I don't know. I, I th he was there in the day, but I, I feel like, you know, they're not they're not fussed. They've got nowhere to go. They live out in the wilderness, so they're there day or night. Okay. I would I would guess. Oh, that's a cool tree. Ah! ah! Okay, we need we need to be careful. <laughs> right, I'm not going to just dig random wood, <laughs> yeah. I think. Learn my lesson. Yeah, that tree was my friend. Oh my, what is this? This isn't a mountain. What? It's like a ziggurat. What? Look. Oh my god. Oh, here's the village. Here's the village. And here's a grave. Look, someone's busted out of their grave. Someone's, oh, that's what, no, no, they're still in there. Look. Oh, there's a pile of bones. <laughs> Pile of bones. Oh, oh, look, oh, you can break it for bones. Free bones. Free bones, suckers. Nice. <laughs> eat, eat lead. Oh, there's a, there's a baby lion. Look at this lion. temple. Should we go up it? Yep. Oh, it looks like it's kind of encroached on the... Um, <laughs> yeah, the world gen's a bit weird. The here. village of... Yeah. Just, uh, just mod things. Excellent. Okay. Let's go see what's in the temple. Okay, we'll talk to you villagers in a minute. Oh, wow. They, look, they've got a windmill. Oh, we get a bird's eye view. Oh, we can steal that, maybe. It's not oh. spinning there. Maybe it's broken. Okay. But look, they've got loads of buildings. And a farm. <laughs> Wait, hang on a sec. I'm not sure if this is a friendly place, Ben. There's a lot of blue shieldy guys Where? spinning around in the village. Do you see them? Oh, yeah. Maybe they're like village protectors. Well, they might be good guys. They this, don't seem to be attacking the villagers. This sounds like a zombie temple, Ben. Not sure about this one. Well, one of our quests is kill ten zombies. Oh, okay. That's 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 a that's a place to start. Yeah, there's a hole in the middle here that looks like I don't want to go in. Mm. That's a big. That's a hard Think... nope from me. Really? <laughs> yeah. I mean. Oh my god! Can you get out? No. No. There's lights down here though. Okay, so it is safe. Well, no, no. I mean, there's a light. Okay, I'm coming down. Uh, I've got some like dirt we can like nerd pole out of here with. Redstone. Oh. There's a random tree in here. Oh, the red, that's what's making the lights, the redstone. Oh, right, I see. Um, what else is in here? Should we just nerd pole out of here? Oh, oh, okay, yep, yep. We'll come back when we've got torches. How about yeah, that? Yeah, you found the hole. I found the hole. <laughs> okay, I do want to come back and explore this place, but um, need torches. Let's go explore the village, Ben. Oh, man, yeah, look at this village. It's so cool. It's huge. We can also see pretty far from up here. Yeah, we've got what this is. There's a mesa over here, and then there's a purple tree land. That looks like a like a magical kind of forest zone. Might find some Ooh. more nymphs in there. Maybe an ent or two. Oh yeah, and there's like for, uh, sand hills. We're close to, oh my god, Ben, what's that red thing? Where? See that red thing? Oh yeah, that's a monster. That's definitely a monster. <laughs> yeah. Nothing red with pincers like that is going to be cool. Although maybe it should be. Maybe. Maybe there should be reverse maybe, world. Maybe crab friend. Yeah. Red crab friend? Question mark? Oh, there's, oh, there's our house. And there it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, so okay, we're pretty close cool. to this temple, it looks like. Yeah. Um, oh, this temple is so big, there must be something cool at the bottom of there's it. There's got to be. We definitely want to raid this and get all the riches of this. Yeah. This, we'll uh, come back when temple. we've got, like, torches and armor. Yeah. Let's, let's raid this village. 
Well, I say, when I say raid, let's go and visit. The trade. <laughs> trade. Let's trade this village. Trade like we did with the Native Americans. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we bring you fire water. <laughs> yeah. You bring us land. <laughs> and riches. Okay, these guys, they, they got they got comb, honeycomb. Nice. He's a beekeeper, that yellow one. That makes sense. Bees are a great way of actually getting resources. Killing you can tame series. the right bees. You can get... Oh, I like these doors. Oh, look at the furniture as well. Is it... Will they get upset if I take everything out of this chest? Um, no. Don't think so. I say take it. Wow. Too late, I've taken it. They've got all the bee stuff here. Look, they've got bee table, bee box, bee houses, with bees in. Oh, wow, well, look at this. Look, you can look in them. They've got things. They've got queen bees and drones and honeycomb. Whereabouts are you in the garden? Yeah, like at the back of the bee house. Oh, yeah. We could bar We could take these. Ooh, ooh. I don't know how to do all the bee stuff, so maybe I'll leave it with them and come back later. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're just on a bit of an exploration at the moment now. Let's let's check out these shieldy guys, see if they're rude dudes. We've got a Fletcher. We've got an Arborist. Um, they've got some Entropy Crystals. These guys don't look good. What are they? Learn. It's an Aegis. Okay. Doesn't say if it's bad or I good. I think it's a, a protector of the peoples. I think it definitely is, but is it going to be angry at us? Only if we're bad to the villagers. Oh, well, we're just stealing their carrots. We're helping them farm. Yeah. Yay, farming. Farming. Those guys are loud. They're not angry, they're not mean, but they are loud. They are loud. Yeah, let's move on. Let's find out what is... Oh, you look cool. Who are you? He's an undertaker. <laughs> oh, he has skulls for sale. What? He can trade skull... Oh, skeleton skulls. He's fermenting as well. Canola look. oil Ooh. out of skeletons? I guess. Uh, and... He's got a coffee machine. Oh. Can we, uh, can we pinch it? Well, it needs electricity. Oh, which, we, which doesn't exist in this he's, world. He's got a canola press. He's making canola oil with. And he's fermenting. And he's got a crusher. There's a whole system here that I don't understand. Oh, this guy's a bit sci-fi. Maybe he's in the future. Oh, oh a laser. What? Mm. This is a bit bullshit. We're not in laser land. We're in warriors and wizards land. It's a coal generator. You put what? coal in. What the hell, villager? To make flux. What? I'm going to take all this wood casing, though, because it's really good for these crates. He's some kind of... He's like Ash from The Walking Dead. He's come from the future to confuse these poor people. Oh, I've never seen The Walking Dead. Not oh. Walking... Oh, sorry. I mean The um, Evil Dead. Ah! From Evil Dead 3, where he goes back in time. Does he go back in time? What does he do? He gets... um. He opens... He reads from the Necronomicon, and it opens a portal to, like, uh, fantasy undead land. Yeah. And um but it sucks through like him and his car. And so he's got his car he's And got, his car. And he's got a shotgun in the back of the car and like a chemistry textbook. That's lucky. And so, yeah. <laughs> and so he gets there and like immediately some knights turn up and say, Who are you, stranger? Um and they try to arrest him and he just like shoots one of them in the face with a shotgun and says, This is my boomstick. Oh my <laughs> anyone God. else tries anything with me and they get the boomy end. Holy shit. That's did it work? Uh, yeah, yeah. They make him like their king. Jesus! Uh, oh man! But then the undead legions attack, and he has to like help prepare the defense. Oh, that's less good, isn't it? Yeah. So he uses his chemistry book to like, you know, make bombs and like turn his car into like a steam-powered thing. Steam power? Why would he? Oh, right. Because obviously there's no petrol. There's no petrol. Yeah. So they make like a steam boiler to make his car into like a death chariot. Oh, this is like the undead with. Pretty good movie. I can't actually. believe you haven't seen Evil Dead Three. It's amazing. No, I watch it. I might watch it tonight. Actually, that's my treat. I'm gonna have some um, some Pringles. Oh yeah. And uh, <laughs> watch some Evil Dead Three. <laughs> oh yeah. yeah. I mean, it's from the '80s, so you know, brace yourself. Um, Living uh, the YouTuber life. I'm gonna sleep in this guy's uh, this guy's bed. Oh, we, can we steal it? We could steal it. Cause your your spawn point's now set here. Oh no! So that's not good. Didn't want that. Make sure we don't die until we get. Home. Although I just broke the bed, so. Oh no, that, that that fixes it then. Yeah. Will it reset to the world spawn or back to the last? It bed will, and in? the world spawn is luckily right next to the house. So okay. Oh, okay. watch out! There's a killipede. <laughs> oh my god! That is legit the most disgusting, <laughs> terrifying thing I've Protect ever seen. Protect me, Minecraft. peahen! I'm, I'm morbidly curious. I think it needs to die. It's too hit. Ah, Enderman, help! You He's looked! I didn't, I was looking at the killipede! Where did you look? It will kill you. It will it kill will you! It will kill me! 
Pick up my stuff! Ah, no! How do I get my stuff back? You just dig the grave, I think, and it all pops out. Oh, yeah. Okay, cool. Luckily, the killipede is confused by trees. And also, I think it's tied itself in a knot. Oh. Should we... Should we double team him? I don't really want to double team a killipede. I want to get near enough to learn what many it is. Spiders? It's called um, conkapede. Oh, I don't want to. I don't want to kill a conkapede. It's hideous. That let's just leave it to the villagers. <laughs> okay. <laughs> the I guess the aguses can can worry about it. These peahens are nice. Is it, what is is a peahen a real thing? Yeah, yeah. That they're they're the lady peacocks. Oh, peacocks I have no are the idea. boys, and peahens are the. Uh, the ladies. Oh, that makes a lot of sense though when you say it like that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, look at this, Ben. <gasps> what? A train station? It's a supply depot and it's <gasps> full of wood. Oh, man. Normally wood is not valuable, but in this mod, <laughs> pre cut planks. Very good. It's like Christmas. <laughs> Take it all. Oh, the juke. But oh, you can play your record, Ben. Oh, I left it at home. Oh, that's probably for the best. <laughs> it's probably terrible. I got a saddle. I can put it on our dragon when we find him. Excellent. And we're going to find him very quickly. I'm right. sure he'll take this tiny horse saddle. <laughs> yes. <laughs> it's designed for me. It fits perfectly. I thought it'd be like a, a, a weird thing. Oh. Oh, Ooh. there's a wasp. Look out. Oh, I hear him. The giant wasp that's on the other side of that house. How? When you say giant. I mean bigger than you. Oh. <laughs> oh, he's big. I see him through the window. Uh, oh, look at these furnaces. Yeah, 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 yeah. So there's also levers oh, here. I hear him. don't know if they're doing anything. <gasps> What's in the chest, Ben? Um, let's check it out. Check, 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 check it oh out. Oh, my God. Oh, we can get armoured up. Yeah, we can skip loads of steps, just like we said. This is great. This is great. I'm going to put some armour on. Boom. I got a chest plate. And we can take all that iron home. Maybe now that we've got... Should we run all this stuff home and then explore that temple? I reckon, yeah, yeah, we've yeah. We've got armor and idea. torches now. I've got charcoal. I'll hold on to some of this stuff. Um, iron ingots. Oh, man, what's worth keeping and what's worth throwing? I just never Don't felt know. like I've had such so few inventory spaces in my life. Well, let's put seeds back. Take gold. Gold sounds good. Oh, you can stack the gold. Oh, yeah, put all the gold in. I'll take all of it. I'm feeling we've both got full inventories. It feels like maybe it's a time to go home. Maybe time to go home. Yeah, let's do it, man. We we this is a great place to come and pillage. So let's come back and demand more taxes in the future. <laughs> oh, are these going to be our? We're going to build a castle and a kingdom, and these shall be our subjects. These are our peasants. They're our serfs. Yeah, yeah. It's yeah. They. It's okay if you call them serfs. Serfs. Because is peasant a bad oh, word? No, no. It's, I mean, they're basically slaves. But you don't call them that. Oh. You call them peasants or serfs, and then, you know, it's fine. It's just, nice. It's not slavery. It's feudalism. Well, well reasoned <laughs> that. <laughs> yeah. Why is this guy growing wheat on his balcony? What? <laughs> what kind of... <laughs> what kind of maniac? <laughs> that's nuts. <laughs> that's that's well, madness. I guess he heard about flower boxes and was like, I'll do one better. Wheat box. <laughs> yeah. Oh, a unicorn. Oh, where? Is that a unicorn? Or is it just a really, like, ripped, stacked rhino? No. You sure? It's, it's a really weird-looking horse. It's not a unicorn. It doesn't have a horn. Oh. But what it lacks in horns, it makes up for in just, oh, my God, the muscles on this boy. Ooh. This is a draft horse mare, white. I want to tame this guy. Bring he's, him home. He's thirsty. I'm thirsty for horse. <laughs> You like apples, don't you, boy? Oh, I got him. Wow. I tamed a horse. Oh, I, I have a saddle. <gasps> Can I ride him? Where, where are you? He's breedable, Ben. The finest stock. Ah, oh, we can stud him. <laughs> We're going to stud. Well, yeah. Oh, my God. I just I see a house in the distance as well. Pop where, on over to me, Ben. Where are you? I'm kind of on the way home, just outside of the house. You can oh, see me on the map. Yeah, I saw horses on the... Um... On the way home, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Oh, perfect. He's not following me, though. What are we doing? Uh, what do horses want? They want carrots or apples or something? Or hay? I'm giving him the apple, and he is... I see, like, hearts. 
which means he's breedable, I guess. Does he want? Does he want the carrot? Maybe he wants... maybe get some a wheat out. No, you know what? I've tried the carrot. Now let's try the stick. <laughs> a wheat? Does he like wheat? Do you like wheat, boy? He does actually. Apparently, like wheat. Cool. I'm I'm back at the house. Okay, I'm I'm on my way home. Okay, I'm gonna leave the horse outside because it's not really inside. Isn't really a place for a horse, is it? So. No, but we, you know, he needs somewhere to not get eaten by zombies, right? Well, I don't think horses like uh, zombies like horse meat. Like, uh, you never see them in IKEA. Well, that's true. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> uh, okay, right. I've got. Where do I? Where do you want to put the storage? Um, we just put two more chests up here. Is it the right? Is it? Uh, the well, I've got oh. the special storage boxes. Ah. Mm. I don't know mm. how to use them. I've got this thing called a cabinet, and I've got these things called storage drawers. How about all along this wall? Because we can connect all these drawers together with a certain, like, there's a controller drawer thing. Okay. So this could be the drawer wall. Where have you gone? Oh, okay, yeah. Okay, so we'll start here. With uh, with the drawers, you want to put in this items that you're going to get a lot of. Right. So I think wood is a good example of something we could put in one of these drawers. Okay. So you just right-click. And you, I think you left-click to take stuff out. Um, and and logs, but honestly, that's all I feel comfortable putting in drawers at the moment. And like, I guess like wheat or something like that. Wheat's a good one, yeah. Let me show you how much is in these storage crates, Ben. So I'll um, just pop them down here. Look how much space you get. In them. Oh wow, they're massive. Yeah. Cool. Oof. Just put a bit. I'm just gonna put a bunch of junk in these because we can get a sorting system. Like you said, you and me have both played a little bit of of. Uh, Ancient Warfare. Ancient Warfare. Mm -hmm. And we both know that the warehouse is actually a really good place to yeah, sort Yeah, it's like stuff. an old-timey computer, and you just have one of your NPCs who's, like, in charge of sorting everything out. Yeah, the man is the computer. He yeah. just thinks with his brain. He's it, like a librarian yeah. for our stuff. The stuff. And we just come in and go, where's the iron? And he's like, hmm, that's in section 42. Let me go get it for you. Can you imagine a stuff library? Like, uh, I'd like <laughs> yeah. to check out um, uh, this, 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 this. Thing. Yeah, it's basically like um, a car, like an armory, isn't it? Like a quartermaster who's like, oh yeah. And you just go in and you're like, give me, give me all the guns. A library for weapons. I like that. I like that a lot. Uh, an armory. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh, just check on these quests then, because we've so we've done tools of the trade, tree complete, completely done. Mm -hmm. The wise adventurer has mob bounties, which means. You have to check bounty boards in villages for mob bounties. Yeah, I didn't see any of those. But you get a, you get a golden apple for it. There's Wizardry 101, which is all about Electro Bob's wizardry. Mm -hmm. Carpentry tools, which looks like it's about furniture. Starts with a seed. Looks like it's about gem, the gem mod, gem farming, mm. which sounds kind of cool. Okay. Uh, engineering training. Research begins. Become an engineer to build your mystical village. I think that the, is... The, yeah, this sounds like the ancient warfare. Yeah, yeah. So we need leather, paper, and iron for that. There's also adventuring tools. Horsey wants a new saddle. Everybody works better with the best tools. Give your horse superpowers. Combine saddle, two cactus, and three leather underneath in a crafting table to make a saddle that hurts attackers. Oh, cool. That's cool. And we completed that quest. Dude, where's my horse? Fairy friend. Oh, the magic fairy dust will enable you to make your own pair of wings. Oh, okay. How do you get fairy dust? Kill a fairy? Oh. <laughs> Feels bad. Oh, no. Show Gringotts how it's done. Oh, and this is the storage one. And then all leather and stone, which is about you will be making a pulvis and a furnace. Oh, so it does have a way to get more or more like ingots out of your ore. I ah, think, okay. Like a pulverizer and then a furnace. Cool. It's pretty cool. And we need bricks and sandstone for that. Hmm. Have you got um, any paper or sugar cane? Actually, I made a wish and I got a piece of paper. <gasps> There's a piece of paper in this top chest I up see there. See it. Amazing. What do you, what oh, do you think? I need, I need three paper. Oh. Um, do you have any iron? I do! I had... We got some from the village, didn't we? Yeah, I've got five. I just wondered if you had any more. Oh yeah, I put some in the storage crate over here. 
Oh, no, you've taken I've it. I've taken that, yeah. I just thought maybe you had some in your pocket. No, I don't, unfortunately. Uh, I'm going to have to go mine and... Are you keen to get... Yeah, because we want to get started with Ancient Warfare, because that's going to have a lot of things that tick over time. And yeah. also, we can I can start building stuff in between recordings for the villagers, like a farm, a yeah, quarry, things like, like that. Exactly. I think it'll be a really... And then that will be our like automation going. Like We'll have the farmer going who will make food for us, and we'll have the miner going who will get materials. While we go off adventuring... Mm. They can that time is then more efficient because they're doing stuff while we're adventuring exactly yeah 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 and yeah. i can also just leave things on overnight and hope they don't die oh they would die <laughs> they will they? definitely oh, die no. uh, but that's kind of the way it goes but we can protect the village we could build a wall uh, yes. get some get some soldiers yeah exactly oh man i really really want to play with ancient warfare oh it's going to be good set up some guard towers with some archers up top oh yeah give them the best bows in the game so it's good. Gonna be good. It's gonna be good. Really good. So, but before we can do any of that, um, we need paper. I need a lot of paper. I think we're gonna need a lot of paper because, like, every time you hire an NPC, you have to give them an order, and that order has to be on paper. Well, wait. Um, hang on a sec. Paper's simple, right? We just need. Oh, I'll take a sleep. Is it sugar? Sugar cane. So if we can. Oh no! What? It said I couldn't rest because there was a monster nearby, and then a phantom came out of my bed. Oh my gosh! It's okay. It's okay. I've had, I'm having a sleep. Okay. While you sleep, I'm going to go... I'm pretty sure I saw some sugar cane at the village. That's and all we need. Well, I'll tell you what. While you get the sugar cane, mm -hmm. I can set up a little bit of a sugar cane farm. Oh, the horse is here. Yeah, yeah I, I parked him out back. Okay. Oh, he's literally... Oh, he's sitting really uncomfortably. How do you mean? Like, he's... It, oh. Imagine, like, his legs are crossed while he's yeah. squatting. So his like back legs, are, his feet, his back feet are like where his front feet should be, and his front feet are where his back feet should be. And he's like Ooh. lying on the floor in his tummy with his legs crossed over each other. It what? looks horrible. What is he doing? Come and have a look. <laughs> oh my what have god! What you done to this horse? He's 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 just. I think he's just collapsed. <laughs> he's, he's just, just mushed his face into the ground as well. Oh, he's sleeping. That's, I, that's just how he sleeps. Okay, I can't put the saddle on him. Well, some people sleep in weird positions, Ben, so I don't think we should judge on that. All right. Well, if that's comfy for you, then fine. What do you reckon about here? And I, li I like this as being like a little personal garden for food and stuff out the back. But over the other side of the house, we can mm. put uh, certainly find a place for um, sugar cane. Ah, okay. Well, it needs to be near water, right? And in sand? I, I'll i use some of the iron we got to make a bucket. The buckets are one of the most useful things you can have anyway. Oh, okay, brilliant. We've gotten quite far into the mod. Well, we haven't really got quite far into the mod. <laughs> We've survived the beginning of the mod. We survived. We did, did we survive? I didn't survive the first night. I didn't survive the first 30 seconds, but that's, that's <laughs> fine. It, it looks very exciting, though. We've got some ideas. We've got some goals. We mm -hmm. want to get an ancient warfare village set up, ready to rock. We want to tame dragons and mm -hmm. ride them. We want to just explore more of the world. There's so much to do. Oh, man. Once we've got our armies and our dragons and our wizards, we can reenact a new ending to Game of Thrones. Yes! Oh, let's remake Game of Thrones <laughs> in Mystical Village. Okay, well, until next time, guys, thank you very much for watching and take care. Bye.